What's happening, everybody? Fish Guy Chris here. How's everybody doing? Hope you guys are having a good freaking day so far. Firm handshakes down in the comments, ladies and gents. Today, it's going to be a good one. We're going back to the fish vending machine. You guys love these videos. Fish Guy Chris is taking his ass over there to get us another fish for my tank or ponds, guys. I got to get one pod for you guys for my channel. Barbara's Buzz in the main channel is going to get, I don't know, we always get a bunch on that channel. So go check out that video if you haven't already. Me and Fish Guy Jack are going bright and early this morning. I already got my protein shake. So delicious, dude. Got my protein shake going hit the gym extra early this morning everybody hit the gym stay healthy get those arteries nice and blood flowing let's hit that bass pro vending machine and get a fish guys like a fish got jack behind me filming look at him caught in the caught in the freaking act filming man both of us taking taking on the vending machine today full force baby feels good i'm excited i'm pumped i think i'm gonna get something good today i think i'm gonna get something good today i've gotten check out what i've gotten so far crazy but it's a good one there he is look at that right there wow look at that that's in the fish vending machine we got a saltwater baby Let's go. Perfect for the saltwater pond that we have. All right, so there he is, guys. That is our cleaner shrimp right there. Oh, uh, okay. I have never seen this before. Look at this. Look at the colors on him. What is, look at that up close. What is that? And let me know what the heck that is. Oh, no way. Yes, it's good. Look at that right there, guys. That right there is an arowana. Baby, arowana. Let's go. That thing is so cool. Here we go. Those are the same thing we got in the other one, except five of them. You know what? I, I'm not mad because I like my guppy tank. I like it. Those are pretty good stuff. So hopefully we get a good one today. I'm excited. All right, guys. We're doing the classic vending machine today. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Okay, baby. We have our mystery fish. We do not know what it is, but we will find out very soon. Hopefully something good. A lot of water in here. That's a good sign. Water oh. equals fish. Let's go. All right, guys, I am back at the fish warehouse. Now I'm thinking, if you guys haven't seen our Barb's Buzzin' vending machine video yet, go watch that first. If you haven't seen that yet, to find out what we got in those pods, I'm not gonna tell you guys what we got, so go watch that video. I will give you one hint of what we got, though. Three saltwater fish. No fresh water we got. They had mystery fish, saltwater fish, and do not press all three saltwater fish. I got the mystery fish from the vending machine today. And what I'm thinking is, obviously, cannot put them in here because this pond is not done yet. We haven't seen part two yet, part three, etc. This is not done still, just running this pond as is. No fish inside, just letting everything chill. So no saltwater pond. Also, the container is very small, so I'm assuming it's gonna be a small fish. So you will not be going in that pond because he will be eaten. And this pond is in harmony. I got this, all the turtles in there. I got the snapping turtle absolutely grilling got all the koi in there the plants the logs that pond is in harmony i don't want to mess with that pond at all everything's doing well in there i'm just gonna leave that as is so i'm thinking he's gonna have to go into the fish guy chris tank in my room that is what i'm thinking so in order for me to put him in there i want to feed everything just in case they get aggressive towards him because we had a little issue with aggression in my tank recently that i need to talk to you guys about so as you guys know i got those two warm mouth sunfish very cool fish, love those guys. I got one big one, one small one. And then we had Johnny and Cash, Cash with the albino, Oscar. For some reason, Johnny completely turned on them and started beating everything up, even though I had minnows in there and feed them every two days. Johnny turned on Cash and completely just mauled him. And Johnny was smaller than Cash. Cash was like double the size of Johnny. And Johnny, being the savage Oscar that he is, went ham. I don't know what his problem is. See, we have a, we have a demon fish on our hands. Johnny is a savage. So, the, so Johnny and the warmouth in there but cash i'm gonna have to get another albino oscar guys cash my boy cash man johnny just he lost it johnny lost it that always happens with oscars guys every time you put something with an oscar it's always like super sketch because oscars are so aggressive and they'll turn on anything at any moment so i need to feed johnny make sure he's stuffed and i'm gonna feed the warm mouth because this fish that i'm getting hopefully it's freshwater if it's salt water i have to go back to the fish guy headquarters and put them in the salt water tank but hopefully it's a freshwater fish and we can move on from there so i got some shrimp let's go feed johnny make sure he's full because he is a serial killer. Gotta make sure he's full. Now here is our fish guy tank, still completely empty, but Johnny, the lone Oscar. You have been a very bad, bad fish recently. The warm out, the big dude is absolutely grilling. I love this guy. He eats like a champ. And right now I'm gonna show you guys how he eats. He's a beast, I love him in here. He's a tank. That warm mouth is really cool. I surprisingly, I really like him a lot. I thought maybe they were gonna be an annoying fish to keep, but he is super cool. Just like a bass, man. He is super aggressive, but he won't get as big as a bass, which is kind of good. Let's feed these guys, make sure they're full, just in case our mystery fish is a freshwater. Gotta make sure these guys are full. As you guys know, I got the shrimp. Johnny actually eats sinking pellets now. So that is a good sign. Super easy to feed him. Much easier than shrimp, but I'm gonna give him something much more meaty today. Now, I don't even get how he 
beat up Cash so bad when he's so small. He was, Cash was double the size of him and he still went ape. So, small piece of shrimp for him. Look how small this piece of shrimp is. That's a small piece of shrimp and Johnny's freaking out. Should we feed him from up top maybe? What do you think about that? Beast, aggressive, oh! The warm mouth got it. See, I'm telling you guys, the warm mouth is also a beast fish. He does not mess around, man. He does not mess around. Now he's fired up. All right, Johnny, what do you got for me, buddy? I like feeding from up top. It's really cool. Warm mouth's gonna, oh, the warm mouth is a beast, dude. He just hand fed. I told you guys that fish is so cool. I love that thing. The thing is sick. That warm mouth just smoked two big pieces of shrimp. That thing's gotta be full now, man. That thing I told you guys, it's cool. It's just like a bass. It's literally a bass. That is so cool, I love that fish. All right, Johnny, try to get this one now, buddy. There he goes, there he goes. Atta boy, Johnny. How about that one, you want those? How about those? See, Johnny gets full so easily, he's just mean. Look, warm mouth still eating. That fish is a beast, love that fish. All right, we got a couple scraps on the bottom for Johnny to eat now. Dude, those fish are savage, I'm telling you. The, big, the, little, the smaller warm mouth is really still skittish because Johnny was being an asshole to him too. So he's always hiding behind that filter there, just chilling. He'll come out and eat at night. I always see him coming out and eating the pellets at night. So that's what we got under control. Pleco's still grubbing. As always, the Plecos eat shrimp too. So now let's unbox what I got at the vending machine today. Let's do it. Now, luckily I defrosted way too much shrimp. So you know what that means? Gotta feed the homies. You guys love seeing the homies eat, and so do I. I literally have a million gallon aquarium in my backyard. It's awesome. Let's see the homies come out and eat. Watch this. Watch how many snappers you guys are about to see. I'm gonna throw it right in there so you can see them good. Look at all these snappers waiting for me. Right when they see me, they come, start coming out from under the dock. So many. I love them. Absolute units of snappers in there. I'm throwing whole, whole, whole shrimp and they're gonna devour it. I'm getting, I'm, I'm growing them up so big guys. These snappers were so small before and now they are becoming giant. I mean, I got some 20 inches down here. Look at that. A literal school of snapper. Come on, that's the last piece of shrimp. Let's go. I love my pet snapper, nothing better than them. <sighs> Absolute beasts. Got a full blown aquarium in my backyard. It's awesome. Now let's unbox what I got at the vending machine. All right, y'all, I got my pod from the vending machine and of course, the glass, the glass jar. You guys love this because you guys can get a good view of the fish. I love showing you guys too. So uh, let us find out what I got today in the vending machine. Okay, here we go. This is my one and only pod that I got. Let's see what it is today. They just restocked the vending machine yesterday. It could be a good fish. Now, here we go. Let's hope and pray. That is fresh water. Because I don't have a saltwater tank and I'd have to drive all the way back to freaking the fish guy headquarters, which would suck. So let's hope it's a freshwater fish. Now let's see what it is in this pot. Oh wow, that is very surprising. This is a good one. Guys, you guys are gonna love this one. This is perfect. This is absolutely perfect. This is absolutely sick, guys. I don't think I've ever had this fish before. This water's really warm. I gotta make sure to, to acclimate him. This water is really warm. I never had this fish before. This is sick. This is a good one. I don't, even, I don't think there's enough water in here to even put him in, but let's just see. You guys are gonna love this. Yeah, there's not much water. Oh, he's feisty too. Look at that. Guys, I don't even know. Is that a shovel nose or a baby marble lacara or something? I don't even know exactly. I'm gonna have to ask Fish Guy Jack because I don't know exactly what this is. Look at that thing. That thing is sick. That thing is perfect. He's freaking out. He's in a, he, he, I need to get his water down because his water's warm. Dude, that's perfect. That thing is sweet. Guys, I think we gotta get him in the tank. I'm gonna get him acclimating and then get him in the tank. That is sick. Name suggestions, as always. Name suggestions. All right, guys, I have acclimated him to the tank and he looks really, really cool. Now, this guy should get big really quick and he's bigger than Johnny, but that doesn't mean anything. Johnny could still beat him up and just decide to murder him. So I'm gonna have to keep a good eye on these guys. This thing is really cool. I'm stoked about this because I do not have a catfish for my tank yet. And this is really the first catfish and it's a really cool one. I did want to get a albino red tail in here, which I still think I might do. Let me know in the comments and by liking this video if I should get a red tail catfish albino for this uh, for this tank. But this is a good first edition. So let's put him in, see how he looks. All right, I drained most of the water. My net is too big to get in there and scoop him up. So just a little bit of water going in. Most of it is from my tank, so that's fine. Now let's see how he looks when I put him in. Here he goes, guys. This is gonna be sweet. Here he comes. There he is. Look at that fish. That fish is so cool. Wow, that is like such a cool addition to this tank.
gonna be great in here. It's honestly the perfect fish to clean up the scraps. So now I can feed Johnny a lot, and whenever he doesn't eat, this guy will just clean up the scraps on the bottom. Look, there's a piece right there for him if he wants. Eventually, maybe tonight he'll go around and eat it. Can you imagine if he eats right now? That would be insane. But look at that fish, guys. That's sweet. I need some name suggestions in the comments below. Drop your name suggestions down there. He is really cool. That thing is sick. I love him. He's so cool. That's a good addition to the tank, guys. I'm very, very happy with that. That, that actually went flawlessly. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We went to the fish vending machine. Let me know by dropping a like on this video if I should go back to the vending machine because I know you guys love those videos a lot. So let me know in the comments and I will see you guys in the next one. Great addition to the tank. Peace.